people have become more and more remote. Sadly for Zimbabwe, the parliament that it elected is not producing any checks and balances. In fact, it has been reduced to a one-party rubber-standing parliament as both sets of parliamentarians are acting incompetently but in unison. Two said developments are unfolding in our country. There appears to be a program to remove people and demolish their dwellings in communal areas. It's, this seems to emanate from a misunderstanding of the law. In terms of the law, the communal land vests in the president. He holds it in trust on behalf of the people. He does not own it. So contrary to the assertions by many people in Zanupiev, the land does not belong to the president. It belongs to the people. He simply holds it in trust. If the demolitions are not stopped immediately and completely, it will constitute Marambachina number two. The second a problem that is developing are calls by ZANU-PF people that President Mnangagwa must get a third term. These calls have been made at official ZANU-PF stages. Our constitution is very, very clear that a president serves a maximum of, of two terms uh, of five years each. It makes it clear 